Hi guys, it's Bags and President Ross. Today we have an updated election map according to realclearpolling.com. Who do you guys want to win? Let us know in the comments. Also, like, share, and subscribe if you would like to support us. Send a super thanks and super si sticker. We would greatly appreciate that super thanks and super sticker. So as you can see, we are on realclearpolling.com. Not our opinion. It's realclearpolling.com's opinion. And uh, the national poll, Trump versus Kamala Harris. Kamala Harris is at 49%. Trump is at 476 And the presidential approval of Joe Biden or Bribe and Biden is 56% 56% disapprove of him, 41.3% approve of what he's doing. Now let's go on up into that beautiful election map and let's fill it in according to realclearpolling.com statistics for October 15th, 2024. October 15th, 2024. Washington state with 12 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Oregon with 8 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. California with 54 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Hawaii with 4 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Alaska with 3 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Montana with 4 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Idaho with 4 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Wyoming with 3 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Nevada with six electoral votes, according to RealClearPolling.com. Trump has a 0.2 lead in Nevada, making Nevada red for Donald J. Trump. Utah with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Arizona with 11 electoral votes, according to RealClearPolling.com. Trump has a 1.1 lead in Arizona, giving him those 11 electoral votes, making it red for Donald J. Trump. Colorado with 10 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. New Mexico with five electoral votes is two clicks, light blue for Kamala Harris. It's not going to swap this election cycle. It might in the future or it might go back to being a hard blue in New Mexico. It's anyone's guess with these polls and what they will end up being in the future. North Dakota with three electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. South Dakota with three electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Nebraska is red for Donald J. Trump. The 1st District of Nebraska is red for Donald J. Trump, and the 3rd or 2nd District of Nebraska is blue for Kamala Harris. Kansas with 6 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Oklahoma with 7 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Texas with 40 electoral votes, according to RealClearPolling.com, Texas is lightly pink, so make it two clicks for Donald J. Trump. Minnesota with 10 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris and Tim Walls. Wisconsin, according to RealClearPolling.com, Wisconsin has Harris at a 0.3 lead, giving her the 10 sacred electoral votes, making Wisconsin blue for Kamala Harris and Tim Walls. Michigan, with its 15 electoral votes, according to RealClearPolling.com, Trump has a 0.9 lead in Michigan, making Michigan red for Donald J. Trump. Iowa, with 6 electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. Missouri, with 10 electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. Arkansas with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Louisiana with eight electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Illinois with 19 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris and Timothy Walls. Indiana with 11 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Ohio with 17 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump and J.D. Vance Hillbilly Eulogy. West Virginia with four electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Kentucky with eight electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Tennessee with 11 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Mississippi with 6 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Alabama with 9 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Florida with 30 electoral votes is 2 clicks pink for Donald J. Trump. Georgia, according to RealClearPolling.com, Georgia has Trump at a 0.5 lead, giving Donald Trump Georgia 16 electoral votes, making it red for Donald J. Trump. South Carolina with nine electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. North Carolina, according to RealClearPolling.com, Donald J. Trump has 0.5 lead over Harris in North Carolina, making North Carolina red for Donald J. Trump. Virginia with 13 electoral votes is two clicks light blue. The 13 electoral votes go to Kamala Harris. Pennsylvania, according to RealClearPolling.com, Pennsylvania has Trump at a 0.3 lead giving Pennsylvania 
the 19 electoral votes to Donald J. Trump making it red. New York, with 28 electoral votes, is blue for Kamala Harris. Maine is red for Donald J. Trump. The first district of Maine is blue for Kamala Harris, and that makes Maine at large red for Donald J. Trump. And also for Nebraska as well is red for Donald J. Trump at large. So the rest of them, we got New Hampshire, Vermont, Connecticut, New Jersey, Delaware, Massachusetts, Rhode Island, Maryland, and the like are all blue for Kamala Harris. This puts Kamala Harris and Democrats at 234 electoral votes and Donald J. Trump and Republicans at 304, giving him the election in a landslide if real clear polling Results were to be taken into account today, and all these states voted according to real clear polling statistics. Donald J. Trump would be back in the White House, and Kamala Harris would be sent packing to California. I'm President Ross. And I'm Bags. And we are out. Woo!